Hello, everybody. Welcome to the day after the Grammy Awards. I know that uh, everybody's inundated, whether it's on your Facebook feed, all over our Mix 108, Facebook, uh, Mix 108 website. We have tons and tons of articles about all the performances last night. So I'm just doing kind of like a quick uh, nerd music blog here to just uh, talk about two things that I saw in the Grammys. First of all, um, I never really liked the Grammy Awards because I think they're kind of stuffy. So I've never been a big fan. Um, but I do want to talk about the two performances last night that really stuck out. One of them was Adele uh, doing the George Michael tribute. I thought that that was really, really cool. Uh, apparently, his family didn't want anybody to do anything. And they kind of talked it over, and they're like, well, if anybody does it, we want it to be Adele. And she's like, so, because she loved George Michael, was friends with him. Um, I thought the song choice was kind of weird of Fast Love, but the backstory on that is when Adele was 10... That was one of the first George Michael songs she ever heard, and she fell in love with it immediately. So she knew right off the bat that's the song she was going to do. Hard song because it's a little faster than she sang. And, of course, if you saw the video, she kind of started breaking down and started crying a little bit. She had to start over, had to start the whole thing over again. But um, she stays true to it, and I just thought it was amazing. Um, and then the time, uh, doing a tribute to Prince along with Bruno Mars was kind of a combined thing. And I thought what was really cool with that, it was all the original members of the time. We're talking Jimmy Jam, Terry Lewis, Jelly Bean, Jerome Benton, everybody. Because Morris Day in the time, they tour, and it's not the same people. So the fact they all came together for this one night, for this one tribute, I thought that was outstanding. And then Bruno Mars, Eyeliner and all, unbelievable. Just did, did such a good job. And um, would be tough. would be tough to pull off. A lot of people have tried to do tributes to Prince, and they've all fallen flat on their face, including Madonna. It was horrible. So um, that was a huge highlight of the night, and the fact that Adele um, said Beyonce should won Record of the Year, good for her, because that was, uh, that was pretty cool. And she genuinely means it. She's a huge Beyonce fan. So um, those two things alone, I thought the Grammy Awards 2017, two thumbs up.